These wait times are ridiculous. The game isn't even, even out. Yeah, no, right? That's what I was saying earlier. Their system is gonna melt when the game comes out. It's just <laughs> You're gonna hear. You're, you're gonna hear on the news. Bioware exploded. The Texas office is no more. People gonna be coming out of the building because the servers got so hot with their faces melted off and everything. No. Spawn back at the med center, so you know, getting camped isn't gonna be that big of a deal. Plus, it, unless you try to rest or attack or something, you have that. Temporary and vulnerability. I have mail. Who do I have mail from? Probably some quest giver who's going to send you a message you're not going to read in like 20 credits. If you do any kind of like, Probably. like treasure hunting or what is it archaeology and your bags are full, they'll put it in your mail. Huh. I still just get a kick off how like quest givers will like hit you up afterwards and give you like money, but it's like such a small me. amount, it doesn't matter. It reminds me when I was like twelve in sixth grade, you know, like playing Pokemon or the Pokemon trainers that you beat would like call you up. <laughs> like, hey, I've got stronger now and come back and let me try and kick your ass again. Then you fail miserably. Then you go and like, you know, bash their teeth in. Because they never called you when they were level appropriate. They call you when you were like 10 levels ahead. <laughs> 231. <laughs> there should be like uh, I don't know. You know how they have the lines at Disney World if you get those passes you can just like skip the line. Yeah, I would pay for that in this. Give me a premium. Even if it was like one hundred dollars per month. No, maybe not that much. A year, maybe. I feel like they had that for some game where a uh... hundred dollars a year—that's less than ten dollars a month. That's less than what we're going to be paying. That. But but you add one. That's what I pay per year for Rift, pretty much. Yeah, Rift's only ten dollars a month, right? And it's only if you got a special subscription. It, it's it's fifteen. Well, I think it's fifteen dollars a month regular thing, and it goes down to like nine dollars a month for if you pay for it by year. Yeah, if you buy it in big blocks, the price goes down per month. But you're paying all that at one time, so. But they also had a special. Uh, if you pre-ordered, you could get a special subscription that was cheaper. Well, if you had a yeah, so I have code. the I have the pre-order one, so. I didn't pre-order a little bit more. Yeah, Chutelis see, gave I me a code. Chutelis gave me a pre-order code, even though I didn't pre-order it. But I used that account to buy the game, so it's same as I pre-ordered it. Like Even one of them was, it was like when it only seven dollars. So I don't know if I'm just gonna pay monthly or if I'm gonna buy a big block. I'm gonna do time card. That's how I always do it. I think their time cards are are two or three month. So you might as well be buying a big block. It's the same. <laughs> well, see, the difference for me is, especially with going away to college next year, it's easier. For me to not like so. All you gotta do is go to Walmart and get one of those prepaid cards. That's how I pay all my online subscriptions. But I mean, I just so put enough on there to pay. Technically, what I need. it saves money because if there's a time period where you're not playing, then uh, it's better than paying fifteen extra dollars. What do you mean? Like if you skip a month without playing, you just cancel your yeah. subscription for that month. Okay, never mind. That is what you mean, right? No. Hmm. Uh, okay, I get what you're meaning. You're saying, like, um, if you just get real busy and forget to play, like, if you yeah. don't plan on it, you just don't go buy a new card, wait until you're ready to play. Oh, okay, yeah, I can see that. And that's what I did with Rift, because, like, I get, like, worn out of Rift, and so I went and play it for three months. 
and then I'd want to play it again, so I'd go out and buy a card. You know you can set it up to not recur. You have to manually do it each month. Doesn't matter. It's easier this way for me. I used to... I used to use game time cards with WoW and Age of Conan. <laughs> this computer store ordered a bunch of them for me and my cousin. And we bought like maybe one card for Age of Conan and they've got like ten of them out there. <laughs> and the game's free to play now. <laughs> <laughs> All right. It's OCD. <laughs> Did you guys see like on the 13th at midday all of the European servers were like this? But the American weren't? That's because they were in a different time zone. I want to know just how many people are playing this game now. Uh, there was 900,000 pre-orders that were, uh, digital download alone. Just standard, or all the versions combined? Just all of them that were online pre-orders. Oh, and online is, is like 30% of pre-orders, isn't it? Yeah, so it's over a million. Maybe not playing right now but we'll be playing yeah and that's not even coming to people who have to like the kids that have to save up the money or are hoping they get it for Christmas yeah or people that are still really into Battlefield 3 which I still play Battlefield 3 it's just this game came out at the worst time when all of these other games that I love came out you got Zelda you got Skyrim you got Battlefield 3 and